Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League group stage fair on the menu. It's Benfica taking on Liverpool. Well, thanks, Derek. It's a real pleasure to be here. What a great atmosphere we've got inside the stadium. I'm really looking forward to this one. It should be a good contest, that's for sure. starting 11 looks for Benfica well in this 4-4-2 the second forward has two jobs firstly to find space behind the opposition's midfield and secondly to help out his central players when they haven't got the ball he'll certainly be key today Liverpool will line up. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Grimaldo Frederic Aursnes and keeping it on the ground slightly off target however Otamendi Aursnes Grimaldo with it Otamendi has it We're getting the ball forward and credit is due for that good piece of defending Possibilities inside the box. Kimi. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. again with the score line standing at 1-0 Gonzalo Getsch oh nice ball over the top to chase now play stopped it is a free kick well, no card from the referee, Stuart. But I think it's good refereeing. He's just letting everybody know who's in charge here. Robertson. Giving the ball away. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. But nothing comes of it. Gakpo. Here's Robertson.
Andrew Robertson. And can they prize them open now? And a long way out here. Oh, my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely sensational. Unstoppable. Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? Because that struck so sweetly. He really does surprise everybody here, not least the keeper. What a good finish that is. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Florentino Verissimo on the ball Florentino Pereira and they have possession again great effort to keep that one in play It's gone out of play for a Benfica throw. Crossing opportunity. And they could get one back here. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And a time for calm on the ball. Nunez. Well, spot on with that challenge. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Gonzalo Getsch. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Well, he was able to make amends. Virgil van Dijk. Pedri. Oh, a lovely ball. And still danger here. Well, I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I can't believe what I've just seen. Well, I agree with you. They don't come much easier than that, do they? What a miss that is. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. No card, but the referee clearly stating that's the last warning. Well, marginally wide. So, so close. Well, he has the measure of his man. And given away. He's got to have a go here. Well, the goalkeeper managed to make the save without much difficulty in the end. Encouraging move from Liverpool. Firing it towards goal. Well, a long-distance effort and a highly respectable one, Stuart. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. It's a decent effort, you have to say. Well, Liverpool have been really incisive today. Their movement, their passing and their end product has been far too much for the opponents here. So, two minutes to be added on at the end. Breaking at pace.
Space afforded him. Pereira. Well, this would help them get back into the game. Well, I think you could call that. He's got to score! So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, he's been a long way from his best up front, Stuart. Well, as you can see, he just hasn't had enough touches in the key areas. And that's one of the reasons they're losing this game at the moment. And away they go again. Just reflecting on what we saw in the first 45. Joyous football from Liverpool. Plenty of support here. And now having a go, and no way through. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Liverpool facing Fulham. And there the attack ends for now. Well, that is how to play advantage. Florentino. Roberto Pereira has it. That'll be a Benfica ball. He continues his run. Gonzalo Gedge. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Chance to finish. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. <laughs> Underway again with the score at 3-1. 30 minutes to go then. Gonzalo Gedge. Gonzalo Gedge. Could pull one back here. Well, as the stats confirm, Liverpool had the lion's share of the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Good pressure high up the pitch. Can he find the right pass? The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Can someone get on the end of this? And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Has a go. And using his body to good effect. Perfect tackle. A Liverpool free kick coming up. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. And there's the delivery. Nicely saved. 
Well, another corner following on from the last one. Not the best clearance. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, he had it on target, but it was never going to trouble the keeper. Throw in here for Benfica. Just 15 minutes remaining. And the referee blows for a foul. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Aursnes. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Is that again? This could reduce the deficit. And in it goes. And you never know in this game. They might yet be able to level it. 3 2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? And almost at full time, Liverpool desperate to make this a victory. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, their attacking play has been excellent. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. Marvellous anticipation. Well, fair play, he took on the shot, but he's not going to be happy with how it ended. Salah. And he takes on the shot. Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Salah. Crossing into the middle. Threat over for now, it seems. Taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Salah. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? This could finish it! Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And he's fired over the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. The sound of the referee's whistle. This match is in the history books and it goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserved their victory. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.